الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم اما بعد from our series promoting the sunnah of the messenger of allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam in the minhaj of the salaf da'wah to ahl sunnati wal jama'ah and refuting ahl bid'ah wal hawa wa zanbaqa jazallah khairan to our brother sheikh ihab al nadir hafizallahu ta'ala who compiled several statements of the salaf and some of our ulama of this time regarding ahl bid'ah and regarding the importance of the sunnah of the messenger of allah sallallahu alayhi wasallam and from amongst those statements hafizallahu ta'ala some of the statements that he collected qal qala ibn qutayba rahimahullah ta'ala inma yaqwi al-batil bi sukut anhu ibn qutayba rahimahullah ta'ala said verily what strengthens falsehood is being silent about it وقال قال قتيبة بن سعيد رحمه الله تعالى مات الثوري ومات الورع ومات الشافعي ومات السنن ويموت أحمد بن هنبو وتظهر البدع Ibn Qutayb ibn Sa'id rahimahullah ta'ala said that when Thawri died then wara or piety and humility died and when Shafi'i, Imam Shafi'i died rahimahullah ta'ala the Sunan died and when Imam Ahmed would die or when Imam Ahmed died bid'a became widespread this shows us the importance of the imams of the salaf and how the effect that they had in preserving this religion qala qutayba ibn sa'id rahimahullah ta'ala idha ra'ayta ar-rajala yuhibbu ahla athar فهو على السنة. كتيبة من سعيد said رحمه الله تعالى if you see a man who loves the people of hadith then know that he's on the سنة. قال شيخ أحمد النجمي رحمه الله تعالى one of our مشايخ of this era who passed away known as the مفتي of جيزان he said رحمه الله تعالى الحزبية ليست من نهج الأنبياء بل هي بدع قال الشيخ أحمد رحمه الله تعالى he said حزبية or sectarianism or calling, uh, dividing yourselves into groups and sects and parties this is not from the methodology of the أنبياء of the prophets عليهم أفضل الصلاة والسلام rather this is بدع this is innovation وقال ابن تيمية رحمه الله تعالى شيخ الإسلام ولم يعرف في الطوائف أعظم من صيف الخوارج شيخ الإسلام ابن تيمية said رحمه الله تعالى he said I do not uh, there isn't a group that is more known for the sword than the خوارج they're the people of bloodshed. 
They're the people of fitna, as we see them all around the world spreading fitna. And we ask Allah the Almighty to protect us from this fitna of the Khawarij and the Takfiriyin. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless Ahl Sunnah everywhere, our brothers and sisters who are suffering in Misr and Egypt, our brothers and sisters in Palestine, our brothers and sisters in Somalia, our brothers and sisters uh, in Ethiopia and Ahl Sunnah, wherever they may be. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala unite our hearts based on the Qur'an and the sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa and bless all the Muslims to come back to the Qur'an and back to the sunnah of the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and back to the sabil al-mu'mineen, the path and madhab of the salaf of this ummah, the pious predecessors, the ones who sacrificed for this religion, the sahaba to rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, radiyallahu ta'ala anhum majma'een, and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless our brother, Sheikh Ihab, Hafizullah Ta'ala, for compiling these very beneficial uh, statements of the Salaf. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.